I am so excited and honored to tell you who my first guest is today. It's a woman who I trust, who I admire, who I love, who I respect. She's the most talented woman on the planet in my book. And she's the reason that I have a show today. I am so grateful to her for this opportunity. Please welcome my friend and mentor, Ellen DeGeneres. Hi, everybody. Hey, Bethany. Hi. Well, hello to you and hello to everybody there. You look great. I, I was just telling my audience how much I love you and how amazing you've been to me. And a lot of people like to make a lot of comments in, in the press about different relationships, whether it's, uh, you know, someone gives someone a show and it's just a business relationship. And I try to explain to people that you and I are really friends. I mean, we actually go to dinner. I hang out with you in Porsche. I've been to your house. I genuinely love you and look up to you and I call you when things are rough or when I need advice and that's just the nature of this relationship. It is. I mean, you have not invited me to your house, but I've invited <laughs> you to mine, so that has happened. But someday maybe, I don't know. So listen, <laughs> here's what I want to say my about that. My ex-husband lives in my I, house, Ellen. Yeah. <laughs> well, then I'm not going there. <laughs> so let me... Let me say this, because I, I only hear about this stuff. I don't really pay attention to what's in the press. But I did hear that there was a story that I was distancing myself from you and from the show, and I wanted my name off of the show. And I think people think that there is, as Andy Cohen said on your show the other day, that there's always a, a, a tiny bit of truth to any rumor that you read. There is absolutely not one crumb of truth in that at all. I, there, I am not distancing myself from your show. I love you. I am. I'm so proud of you, and I'm proud to have my name on it, and I think that you're amazing, and we are friends, and the only reason we're doing this by satellite is because I'm filming here and you're filming in New York, and, I, and you know that I tried to get you to film in LA here on the lot so we'd be closer together and I'd be there every day if I could, but you have your daughter and your daughter's there and, and you, you know, are there with your daughter and I respect that. But that's the only reason we're so far apart and I, I love you and it's ridiculous that people are trying to make stories about this because I think you're doing great. I'm just going to compliment you as much as I can right now because I want people to understand how you are there's no one doing what you're doing on television right now. You really represent women and, and talk to women and give women advice in a way that nobody is doing. And, and I love listening to your advice. I don't know what the hell you're talking about most of the time, because it's, you know. But, you know, you're talking about stuff that, that is necessary. And, and I think the more you get to have this platform and help women and talk about things that, you know, that you you can help them through. I know that it's, and it's also a safe place. A lot of women go there and talk to you and reveal things that they wouldn't do on other shows. And, um, and you can't really talk about what's going on in your life right now, and I know that, and I know what's really going on, and I know that's really hard for you to not share how difficult a time this is for you. So um, that's weird, because you do share everything with your audience, but you're not allowed to talk about your divorce. So I'll, uh, I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> 